Hi, in this video I'm looking at this question here where we're asked to calculate the final amount at the end of $1,500 invested for 15 months at 5% per annum simple interest. So with this question we're after the final amount, how much the investment will be at the end of it, how much money you'll have at the end of your 15 months. So to do this we first need to calculate the simple interest and then add that onto the original principal. So let's have a look at what we've got. We've got our principal of our question, which is how much we're investing. We're investing $1,500, so we've got $1,500. We are after our rate, so our rate is this 5% per annum, so 5%, but we want it as a decimal, so we're going to divide that by 100 to convert that to a decimal, so 0 0.05. And we want our time or term of the investment, which is this 15 months. Thing is though, with 15 months, simple interest and all our interest works in years, so we're going to want to divide this by how many years, uh, months are in our year, so 12, to find out the fact that 15 months is 1.25 years. So now we can go to our simple interest rule, which is simple interest is P times R times T, and we can put this information in. So we have a simple interest of 1500 or 1500 times a rate of 0 0.05 times our term of 1.25. Putting this into our calculator, we end up with a simple interest of $93.75. So in one and a quarter years, we have earned $93.75. But that's how much we've gained. We want the final amount. Now our final amount is going to be our principal plus our simple interest. So to get our final amount, we take our initial principal of $1,500 and we are going to add on the simple interest we just calculated, $93.75. Add those two together and we find out that at the end of our investment, we're gonna have $1,593 and 75 cents. So if you're asked for the final amount of a simple interest investment, then you need to calculate the simple interest first and then add that on to the final amount to get the answer.